feels alive. Extreme ice freeze, K on, waking town, weather forecast, UK, so one free. Like this video, please a thumbs up. Tighten them out in digital to the moment and analog. It's 9.46 a.m. in the morning. And it is the 18th of January, so one in three. Happy birthday, my friend Rory. It's my friend birth Rory's birthday today. He's 17 years old. I wish him a happy birthday. I think it's on the front screen tonight. You can see the base net canal, it's actually completely frozen over, about an inch thick or so. You can see over there in the distance the fr frost on the grass. It's very cold, so it's not that high. Minus three Celsius across Waking Town locally this morning. It's very cold. I mean, minus four Celsius this morning across around, around Waking Town locally this morning. This cold weather is going to continue straight into next week. I believe that will be the uh, up to the, um, wow, you name it, guys. The 28th of January, next Wednesday, guys, which will be very cold in the morning. It might be a little bit of frost, but it probably won't be too much. But yeah, it was supposed to end, end originally on the 19th of January uh, with the weather forecast originally by Met Office, but it's changed, guys. This weather forecast is set to change again, though. As I keep saying, guys, the future weather, they do three hours, the weather's changing, and the forecast is changing. I wouldn't be surprised if we get a beast from the east next month. We have got uh, shows you warming on 10 HP at the North Pole, guys, going at the moment. No joke. And yeah, we are talking about um, it's going down from 30 H to 30 HP where the weather takes place. Uh, the troposphere, guys, with the strategy warming going on, which will create what we call a, a northern blocking over, well, beasts from the east over Scandinavian High or over Greenland blocking, which is the way towards northern blocking, which we might get in February into March 23 this year, which might well be cold and snowy, just like the year 2018. Remember that year, guys? Or it could be just a displacement like in 2021, um, January, guys. Um, which we've got, it's still got cold weather, so yeah, so we can still get some northern blocking, and, and that continues right into the spring. And that summer 2021 was very cold across the UK. It was a wet, and horrible summer. It was the hot weather down in Hampshire, the south coast of Portsmouth down there 2021. You're going to archive historical videos, you'll enjoy them. But yeah, so it's all to play for the future. So I wouldn't be surprised um, if we get this one more cold blast, this cold snowy weather, or, or cold snap, or even a beast from the east at the end of February into March 2023 this year. We'll get it and anyway. I'm, I've way where cold air will come out of the North Pole and we'll get some cold weather. Like we last did last year uh, in 2022 spring. You remember last year's 2022 spring, March into April. That's on April's full day. It was very cold and snowy. And it wasn't that sort of settling. A little bit did, but it was very cold, wasn't it? So we're going to get cold weather again, guys. This spring will be cold this year. I'm predicting a cold spring in 2023 this year for the UK, the South East Southern Wings. I'm always at 5%. More weather for customers that have got to this. More and more. I'm a different man of the galaxy. No, Joe, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for the thumbs up. This is Scrape, this is Sean Slime Jails. This is my friend Sparky. Jimbo on the ITF Friday feeling on the Surrey Hills Radio Station show at 3 to 5 pm and analog digital that's 1500 to 1700 and listen to me on last show at 9 a.m. to 12 pm with John Andrews on the Waking Race Station every Sunday. I take care on this roads today, they're very icy and on the pavements. There are a lot of accidents out on the roads today, a lot of people take it unnecessary risks. Do not take any of these risks, take care on the roads, take care. It's very icy today on the roads. So the yellow, yellow warning is off out there, that's today because the county so locally and for South East or something reasons. And in Cornwall, it was snow this morning. I did predict yesterday, I'm always 85 percent right by the way, because Cornwall as well. And the best way I'm going to get out of here. That's what you're doing here. Thumbs up. And subscribe to us on Sound Gems. And of course, we wish you always got that spot when you need to know many. That way, in the YouTube, because we are literally west of Waking Town on the Basin Canal right now in St. John's Village. This is Sound Gems. Might be happy.